What is going on, guys? Welcome to another session. And uh, before we jump straight into it, I just want to take a quick look at the ranks. Even though I lost like 30k, 30k rating like uh, a couple months ago, and just by messing around, I actually got back up to 58, rank 58. So. I didn't expect that, but we just continue to mess around until we, you know, I'm not gonna reach to the top with this off account by playing like how I played. Because if you want to even get into top 10, you have to be very dedicated, um, top tier faction um, player. So, which means you're gonna play a lot of Lizardman, a lot of uh, Tomb King, especially because Tomb King right now is just out of control. But for me, you know, I like to play um, a lot of factions, and I like to enjoy a lot of matchups. So, <clears throat> you know, I'm not really gonna aim to uh, get to top ten or maybe top five. I'm just gonna mess it around on the ladder. That's basically what I was going to do. So, without further ado, let's jump straight into it. <coughs> Alright. Why is everybody playing uh, Kingdom Come Deliverance? Is it good? I watched some footage and it's about FPS medieval um, background. I like my evil background, but I don't like FPS games. <laughs> Alright. Looks like we're gonna play Britonia. I can do chaos against Britonia. I like to play chaos a little bit today. Do I have at least? Yes, I do. Alright, this list looks uh, looks quite okay actually. <coughs> I'm not too sure why I picked these guys. I don't think I need. Because uh, they're just gonna lose to those uh, knights. Pretty much, I just need fighting power, in my opinion. Do I need Gobi's chariot? Yeah, probably. Or I just get more infantry. More infantry. <clears throat> get four of these. Yeah. All right. <clears throat> this should be better. So basically, uh, I'm not really a big fan of Final Transmutation because uh, it's got nerfed. So basically, Plague of Rust and uh, Transmission of Elite is is gonna do it. And the reason why I take Chaos Knights is because these guys are uh, much better in melee combat. So in a calf against calf situation, these guys are actually gonna um, do much better um, than the Chaos Knights with lances. And in Bretonia matchup, there will be a lot of calf against calf action going. So yeah, and. The other thing is, uh, I take Forsaken because they are very fast moving on the flank and I just need to make sure they don't eat a charge so I need to have some of these Marauders to stream for them. Other than that, I think I'll be alright.
So you basically just uh, go ahead and punch a hole. Try the best. Is this guy gonna swap faction? No. All right. Cool. All right. So we kick off the day with uh, chaos. Let's do this. I like this game, it's very fast loading. So you basically If I'm gonna do anything, I if I'm gonna push through here, I can't really go very wide, so I have to go very in depth. Not too sure, but uh, should be fine. These guys are there. Group these guys for now. And then divide and later. <coughs> right, same numbers. Okay, that's not a good sign for Bretonia. I think as Bretonia, you need to outnumber chaos a lot. So I should be facing a lot of calves. Good luck, uh, cow shucks. <laughs> Alright, he's hiding his army somewhere. Uh. There you go, right there. So I'm gonna just push forward to about here. Nice Aaron. Can't see the rest of his army. What's the speed on this guy? 60. So that's not too bad. Lots of realm, grow knights. Full squads at the back. That's fine, actually. That's very fine. You just basically move this direction. Get my knights in position. <clears throat> Get these guys out back. Get these in the front. And you basically just switch your nine screen. Running away. K 
Kindle and Grail Guardians. Alright, come back. Running away, it's not gonna come back. So everything's it's like melee. Come up. Let's do this. You're gonna eventually come down, right? I'm just, uh, I don't know.
I think I got this. This is very easy, actually. Fuck by everything. And GG. Alright, uh, that took a while. But uh, he was trying to win the tactical game by hitting me from different angles. But um, I was able to just focus on um, one aspect. And at one time and slowly just uh, gained all my mm, advantage and finally got the win so basically I was uh, I was patient and the more I play this game the more I feel that you have to be patient from time to time to deal with the situations because uh, for example I could easily lose this game by uh, just charge forward onto that that hill so everything I got we're just stuck here and you know just stuck here fighting uh, an uphill battle while it just get cycle charged in the back by those knights so that was the worst thing could happen all right let's speed up see how this actually broke down so I can't see everything here so just that's why I moved I'm push forward and then shifting my nine because I saw his uh, bulk of uh, infantry that was uh, four spears, four squires Kinnun, Grail Guardians and he's very hesitating from time to time and I casted a Black of Rust and did some damage to the Squirrel Knights and then I'm just pushing in he's coming back pushing in again and then I kinda just stopped because I need to deal with the 
those guys. As you can see, the tactic view. I'm actually full surrounded by those Britonians. And right about here, I finally got a favorable in engagement. And because he moved a little bit slow, so I, I engaged the Squirrel Guardians as well. And here, I engaged these guys with one of my knights. So I divided my knights into three quarters to fight um, three quarters of his knights. And bear in mind that, as you can see, here, my Chaos Knights are supported by Forsakens. Here, my Chaos Knights are supported by Chaos Marauders. Here, once again, they are supported by Chaos Marauders. And for Bretonian Knights, they don't have any infantry mass to support them in these engagements. So that's that's basically the reason why I can come on top on this uh, knight's engagement. And I have just enough infantry to hold his infantry. So yeah. The spear is going to die horribly to those for seconds. Watch just how fast they're going to die. <laughs> Melted. So anyways, yeah, and uh, Loom Puff his ability, I retreat with my stuff a little bit and just charge those swords in the back. Basically route them instantly. Yeah, and just pop stand you die and basically just there's no chance coming back for him. Cause uh, he he lost a lot of calves before the infantry I mean right about infantry about to engage. And then I just have more calves left so yeah that's basically I think without the support of spears it actually cost Bretonian the game <laughs> the kills on the Forsaken man incredible uh, I'm not gonna cast this game though uh, but I can show you here right Okay, now yeah, let's keep playing. Skittles, 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 Skittles. Do you want to play Dwarf? Or do I just want to play High Elves and Loose? <laughs> well, I don't know. Maybe just play Skaven. Get a lot of stroke. These are all very good spells. Armor bone, probably. Nah, I don't need. I need Roman Tide. I need that. Do I want to get this Wrath of Corruption? I don't know. I honestly don't know. Okay. And then just clan rats, six of them. Mm, big rats, six of them, probably. I'm just going full retard right now. Mm, got around there. Yeah, I have heaps of money left. Heaps of money.
I don't know if I need Doom Wheel or not. Probably not. I mean, right now I'm just going full retard. But uh, I just want to test, you know. Because uh, this could be very fun. Just a fun test, you know. open map as well so uh, that would be my advantage. I'm uh, not too sure about gutter runners and uh, those things but I think my rat's gonna do it. So you basically have clan rats spread out. And then you have this storm roaming. Right behind them, get stuck inside one of them. And then you just have Rat Ogres basically. Not too sure whether this is only easy or not, but just get the Skaven Snipes on the flank, just group lock everything. 600, wow, that, that looks very cheesy, <laughs> to be honest, but yeah, not too sure whether he's got enough. <clears throat> Basically just outlumber and, uh, and win. Alright, Cygors. There you go. My rats are my rats are too much for you, man.
Basically, there's no chance. There's no chance for you to win. <laughs> There you go. Basically just overrun then. With your rats. And that's it. That's all you gotta do. Spastical hurts. Yeah, they did alright, but... You know. Once the rats come in, they're just gonna die. <coughs> Not much to say. <laughs> Just basically overrun this man. Dark elves. Okay, let's try my high elf build. Hopefully, I can lose. So I can bash my brain again to think about something else to deal with dark elves. But in theory, I shouldn't lose this game. But uh, let's see. Let's see if he's gonna bring more Rathi or not. Set up. It will be done. Sword master of Pond. Get my sword masters here. Get the spears on the flank. Get my dragon princess. Just right behind these guys. Orders received. And get my golden sea guards. So they outnumber us a lot. Let's see if we can still win.
dark shots with shields, okay. These guys, I just need to kill these executioners, basically. We will obey for duty. Loyal without fail. Swiftly setting forth. Not them seagulls. For the king. Spearmen, as you say. Alright, there you go. I think my plan actually worked. Easy fight. Swordmasters did the job. Yeah, that was very good. I can just keep healing them as well. So yeah, we did a very good job. Alright. Mm. <coughs> Hi, Elves. Okay. 
Should I try Tomb King? I can. I just get a free win. <laughs> or I can try... Dwarves, even. I can try a lot of stuff against Hives. Let's try Orcs. Yuna? <clears throat> Get three of these. groups. Uh, I don't think so. Need miso calf. That's gonna be a lot of money. That's the arrows. Don't need the charge bonus, no. Get goblin arches. Get that. But, uh, I can even just get savage orcs. So we joke, boys. I don't know. Savages on the flank. Alright, let's do this. Should be found. Black is the new green. Black is the new green. This uh, savage begins. Gonna keep them around for day.
cause some of piercing damage. Small moving arrows. Strong arrows. Yeah, you should do that. These little things might just help me to win. Okay. It's an uphill battle for us. This side. Seal hams, seal hams. No casting. Why are you guys getting caught? This is ridiculous. Come back. Shoot these guys. Grab two of my beacons, I have good three, and chase for this guy. I think this guy is pretty much dead. There you go. GG. Like, this is just how easy us orcs to deal with high elves. You basically just get a lot of infantry and you just go ham. And there's no way. Uh, there's no way this high off stand a chance, especially when you pop the walk on top of everything. Walk is just gonna basically kill everything.
All right, Master Eagle. Master Seagull. Master Seagull, how about... How about Chaos? Let's play one more Chaos. Then maybe play some Skinks after this game. And I think that'll be for today's session. All right. This is actually a very interesting matchup. I love playing this matchup. I can't wait to see how this army gonna perform against Dark Elves. Rafi. Time is ticking. There you go. So in this case, I need to group them simply because I want uh, them to perform. You basically have two chosens in the front. Cast Marauders. Basically, have uh, these chaos warriors. At the back. Then you have two helps you need. Dark shots. Two dragon. Two black gods. No cap. Yeah, there's no cap. That's very interesting. All right. So let's uh. Let's punch a hole. Get these guys out. Running, 
There you go, he give up. <laughs> Alright. Oh well. <laughs> Barely lost anything. This is very funny though. I want to watch the replay. You play leaders. That's the question. American Pie. Seriously. Dwarfs, leaders, or vampires? Dwarfs, maybe? Let's play at least one dwarf game. I mean, I could just lose, you know, dwarfs. Uh, dwarfs has this tendency to lose games. Wow, dwarfs against empire. All right, let's go. Dwarfs against empire. Could be very hard for me. Let's see. Oh, hi. Alright, here Alright, good luck in the battle to come. I love Vampire. Uh, if you watch my channel for uh, if if you watch me for long, you know that I used to play. Uh, I used to main Empire, and uh, I'm not. I'm not trying to um, say that I'm very good, but I think I was very capable of uh, using Empire against. All factions, pretty much. I used to uh, in all hammer one ladder. I used to play uh, this account and got to maybe rank three or something, and it was like empire only. So yeah, uh, you know those days. 
Alright, so I'm gonna deploy on this side and just get my bow thrower up a little bit so that they can fire into stuff. Even here, <laughs> the range is still just not good enough. And there should have three of these guys in the front. They have ruined us. Long beards. Long beards. Axes out, lads. These rangers. You have troll hammer. Slayers. You have a reserve unit. And you have two more Lombies on the side. It takes a long time to organize everything. When you actually get everything, you're always gonna have enough time to do it. There you go, cannon spam. I'm just sick of this, man. Seriously? Pushing. You don't have any calf to protect. No. These are all on food. Sorry, buddy. This is just not gonna do it. Then. There you go. War machine ready. Dead I'll get up. Yes, Lord. Iron Drakes. Go. Reach for, reach fast! For the 
ancestor gods. We demand blood. Bring your targets well. Stop us! Hey! Take your targets well! Have at them! What? Too ready! You'll burn all! Blow through! Iron tricks! Take them down! Yes! Shoot the wizards! Ready to strike! Iron tricks! There you go. GG. That was a very good game, I should say. Six great swords, four cannons. Just pure cancer. Um yeah, pure cancer. Alright, let's watch this. I think I I did alright in terms of uh, surviving. This guy obviously had a game plan. Just didn't work. <laughs> Alright. Right. There you go. Retreating, shooting them. Keep shooting them. Counter charge. Just shoot them. Damage those great swords. And that's it. It was very hard, to be honest, because those great swords are very good at killing my dwarves. <laughs> and but throw hammer is carried again, so yeah. I think I'm gonna save this game for the cast. I think that's definitely one of the battles that I want to cast. There you go. Save that one. And maybe play one more. And uh, then just end this session. <laughs>
Alright. Looks like we're not gonna get any games. There you go. Hi. Okay, I think the lock. Dude. Alright, what should I play against Chaos? Vampires. <laughs> um, I don't know. Oh man. Yeah. <laughs> Hmm. Probably a better off doing things like this. Perhaps. Or perhaps not. Either way, I need. I need to deal with the skirmishes though. Not too sure what should I do. Should I use Manfred? Perhaps. Get Manfred, uh, Dragon. Get Spirinage, get Fedobuna, get this. Get this. Get the item. And then... Get this. Get one of that. One of this. Three skeletons. Need more mass. Belief. That should be fine because uh, I can just keep summon stuff to help them. Four infantry. Let's see how these gonna break down. Hmm. I'm not too sure though, but it really depends on what chaos gonna bring. If chaos gonna bring a lot of skirmishes, I just constantly need to. Mm, summon and get rid of them. Okay, I'll count the other children. 
Cast Trolls Armored. Cast Warrior helps. You know what? I'm gonna. I'm gonna fail up you, not these guys. Make sure these guys don't come back. That's what I should do. So there are still 40 of them. Here's warriors. Let's go those guys out.
was weak, with this true power. I hunger. There you go. That's very hard, actually. <sighs> I think I need to work out my lists. Because I don't have much staying power. Oh, these are chosen, so that's why. Yeah. Anyways, um. That was very bad. From my part, but I still managed to win. So that's just how broken this matchup is. But they do beat all my stuff, though. Right. So, what would be a better way to do this? I still think Memphrey is the way to go. Okay. Or maybe Duke, not Memphrey. So get Memphrey. Get two zombie dragon. How are we gonna do it? Obviously we need this. We need 
crit pause. Meet the tide. Just basically a lot of mass, in my opinion. Cause so you're gonna cut through one, two, three, four, five, six, six zombies. And four skeletons to get to my line uh, to get to the mortis. And when you get to the mortis, I still have creepers there to protect. So, yeah. BC mm. against chaos. And I think I need mobility as well, so. One of these guys. So three zombies, four skeleton warriors. Yeah, perhaps. Need an item. So I can get infinite mana. against chaos. Save it. Hi. And that will be the end of this session. Hope you guys really enjoyed it. And for now, Oracle Bells is up. Peace.